Hey, this is Mark coming to you from Baker's Green Acres. Today is Tuesday, and you know what that means. It's Two Minute Tuesday. So I hope to be able to explain a principle to you in two minutes or less. Today, I want to talk about utility on the homestead. Throw two minutes on the, on the clock. Ready? Go. Okay, utility on the homestead. The mindset out there is if things aren't done perfectly, then I probably shouldn't do it. Today, we poured concrete. We have a building that we needed a floor in so we could do some other things in it. Pouring concrete is not my specialty, but I was able to form it up, uh, get the correct grade, take the measurements, call the concrete company, tell them how much I was going to need. The man showed up with the truck, he dumped it, we raked it out, he ran over it with a screed board, showed us how to do it, and then we had a bowl float that we went over it. And when we were done, we had a pretty good looking product. And we stood around and we talked about this, and we talked about a lot of the processes that people don't do because they think it has to be done perfectly. It will be no time at all where that floor is gonna be covered with kitty litter, and oil absorption stuff I'm talking about, and, uh, and dirt, and straw, and all kinds of stuff. No one will ever think, gee, there's a ripple in that concrete over there. So my charge to you today is do the thing, and you will have the power. And this applies to just about anything we do on the homestead, whether it's cutting meat, painting cars, delivering babies. Utility is good enough. Gee -gee. Okay, if you've done something that was not perfect but worked, please drop a description of it in the comments. And while you're at it, like, share, and subscribe. Anyone can find it.